All right, sails down, sails down, sails down, sails down, sails down. Ooh, ooh. Let's try the double sail. All right, so let's set sail. I think a storm came in though, so this might not be the best time. We are going almost twice as fast as before. Ooh, whoa, 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 okay. My ship doesn't like that. All right, put the sails down, put the st We lost one, we lost one. Just, just throw it in the ocean. We don't, we don't need that anymore. Get out of here. All right, put the sails back up. What's going on, guys? Welcome to Make Sail, an open world survival story game. In the way that you create your own boat over time, and you need to find these chimes on these different islands all around the ocean and bring them to this tower in order to complete the story of the game. The coolest mechanic of this game is going to be building your boat. You have full creative freedom over how you build your boat, how the boat looks and how it works, the sails, the chests, everything like that. And you can also explore these islands, get attacked by creatures, monsters, and everything in the water as well. So it's kind of got a Sea of Thieves vibe to it, but it's a lot more of a creative, like freedom type of game. And it gives you like the freedom to do whatever you want. So what we're gonna do is jump in and we're gonna continue the story and let's get into it. The tower brought light and music to my ancestors. It's ringing chimes spread calm and prosperity. Okay, so yeah, they're like wind chimes. That's kind of cool. So this is on a sail. For a time, all things were perfect. But distant islands called the Restless People? Hmm. And they took the chimes. Wow. So I'm assuming we gotta go take them back. The tower missed the people and the chimes. So the tower is a living thing. Okay. Years of lonely has turned inwards. Oh no. So a terrible storm burst from the tower. Tried returning what chimes still remain. But the storm scattered our fleet. Holy crap. I woke alone inside the eye of the storm. So I'm about to wake up in the eye of the storm? Oh, doesn't sound like much of a storm anymore. Or it's just kind of like a windstorm. Oh, look at me. Kind of got a little bit of like a Zelda vibe from this almost. Okay. Inverted mouse. One of my least favorite things of all time, but when it comes to sailing, it kind of makes sense. So there's the tower. Return the chimes to the tower. Oh, is that where I'm going to create my boat? Hell yeah. Let's go down there. Let's go create my boat. Shall we? Ha! Huh. Let's jump right into it. Okay, so building. Spin. Pan. Zoom. Delete. Drag, rotate, undo. All right, hopefully they hold on to that there because I'm not going to remember any of those at all. All right, so let's go. There's four different building pieces. So we have structure, lift, utilities, and movement. So I'm going to start with movement because it looks like we don't have a sail right now. The boat seems a bit big too, don't you think? But at the same time, maybe we should make it longer, not wider or something like that. Maybe it would be a lot easier to work with, or we can just add more buoyancy to it. So, let's do the big giant sail. You guys will see how the building works now too, which is wonderful. It's like a bunch of snap points. Like I said, you have full creative freedom over whatever the heck you want to do. And then let's just give ourselves a little bit of extra lift. Maybe if we can get one of these onto the side. I just need to get this dang camera to do what I want it to do. All right, let's do, there we go. Can we get it a little lower? Yeah, there we go. Is that right on the bottom? I don't know if that's gonna work. I guess we're about to find out though. So let's just set sail as is right there. Uh, we could double sail it as well. I don't know if that'll work, but we're gonna try it. And we have a narwhal horn. So in case we can't attack by a narwhal, if you guys don't know what a narwhal is, 
then you've never seen uh, Buddy the Elf. That right there, a narwhal horn, or should we just, we should put this on the front. So we can ram, right? Give me a front somewhere. I see a little front peg. But I can't bring the narwhal horn forward enough. There we go. We have a narwhal horn. Heck yeah. Uh, what are you? What the heck is that? What? That's a big giant floating puffer fish is what that is. All right, we'll do a little lantern action. Maybe some lantern actions on the sides, maybe? Okay, so what is this? Royal blue chest, look, game's made for me. So to make the ship balanced, we're gonna put it kinda, let's put it up front a little bit, cause we're gonna have a lot of weight in the back. Might as well spread our weight out evenly. A short blue plank. Eh, not really in need of anything like that. Let's set sail, let's try it out. It's time to try your first boat. Try turning your ship if the wind hits your sail from behind. Okay. You never permanently lose pieces. There's no shaming swimming to shore. Press R if you get stuck. Okay. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. Scoop, ba, ba, da. Well, that didn't work out too well. I think we got too much wind going for us. So let's get rid of that. And we turned really fast and it made us flip. So maybe if we extend the hull a little bit in both directions to make sure that we don't do that again. <laughs> That's not what I was trying to do. There we go. Maybe a couple of planks. And let's do a little bit of that. There we go. Some walls on the sides maybe. And there we go. A couple of walls on the sides. All right. We're a little bit wider now. I think that we should probably have like some backup buoyancy. So we put that there. We have density in top right. I'm just noticing as well. So this will be like a backup buoyancy. If we start to tilt to the side, these will take effect and try to keep us afloat maybe. I mean, that might just be me overthinking everything, but I'm hoping that that's the case. Okay, nice and easy, nice and easy. Let's give it a another try. All right, here we go. We're just gonna place you right here, shall we? All right, I believe in us. All right, go a little bit left, go a little bit right. Look at us, dude. All right, let's try to go to an island, shall we? So having those little buoyancy things on the side really does help a lot. Wow, that's awesome. Okay. Wonderful. Beautiful. I feel like we built pretty much the best boat to begin with. And this thing will get bigger and cooler as time goes on. So W... Oh, we can raise the sail, we can lower the sail. I'm assuming that's how we stop. Right? So we have this island right here. And let's try not to crash into it, because I did see that you can crash into it. So let's go ahead and lower the sail now. Oh, no, no, stop, 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 stop. Oh, oh, oh. We may have... May have lost one of our little... One of our little things there. That's fine, though. That's fine. That's no big deal. We have a thing right there where we can edit boats anyway. All right, so let's go to shore. Let's see what the heck's going on. Is there going to be a wind chime here? Or... So what are you? Ooh, a big yellow barrel. Oh, so if we go island to island, we're going to find more upgrades and whatnot. So that's cool. Let's jump on board here. Here's our ship. All nice and fixed, but we have that new yellow barrel. So the density of that is the exact same thing as these red ones. So maybe it'll keep us above water a little bit more. Maybe we could put it like on the front somewhere. It stinks of fish apparently. I mean, it's got a big fish symbol on it, so I would assume, oh, that's not what we wanted. I want to put it like up here somewhere. Or we could put it in the back for some back support, but it's kind of hard without, you know, we have the little, the paddle back here. Whatever the proper term for that is, just going to anger anybody and everybody that does anything with uh, boats at all. I think for now, I might just go and keep what we have here. 
because I think it's working. We can get to another island and we can go find some more parts. Which way do we want to go? That's the island we started on. I don't want to go to the island we started on, but I should go to that island right there. I also kind of want to check out the uh, island there. Raise the sail. So every time we visit an island, it seems like... Uh, turn. Ooh, look at me, dude. Turn, 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 turn. Not too much, not too much, not too much. We're good. We're fine. Honestly, this is a really dang good boat. All right, now we can just go straight. We just need to keep it right slightly. Keep it right slightly. Yeah, here we go. Wonderful. Those two little barrels on the sides really do help with uh, the creation of this boat. It keeps it afloat for sure. Okay, we're coming in fast. All right, sails down, sails down, sails down, sails down, sails down. Ooh, ooh. Okay. Just another rough landing. It's fine. It's fine. We're good. There we go. I don't want to build my boat right now. Okay, so that was accidental. So now I want to go back to the island. Go back to the island. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Go back to the island. I don't want to leave the island. I don't want to leave the island. No. Ha! Jump off! Wonderful. And we can just call my boat back later. Here we go. Nothing here. See you later, boat. Have a great time. Peace out, Girl Scout. There's nothing on this island. Maybe if I just look around a little bit more? Anything up here? Nope. I don't see much. I don't see much at all. Alright. My boat's just floating off over there. Alright, let's rebuild it again. So we can just click set sail because we like the way it works. Let's go crash land onto this. I want to see what happens when you crash land. And right, here we go. Crash land time. Hey, hey, hey. Quit it. I want to go... I want to go to the tower. I want to go to the tower. I want to check it out. I also want to crash land and see what happens to my boat. Here we go. We're gonna hit. We're gonna hit. We're gonna hit. Are we though? I think we're gonna hit. Here we go. Well, oh, there goes my sail. We're not we're not going anywhere now. Whoa! It came up and then went down. Whoop! My narwhal horn broke off too. Narwhals, narwhals swimming in the ocean. Best song ever. Google it. Thank you. So I'm not sure what we do here. I'm looking around. It looks like there might have been some buildings here at one point. But I'm assuming it really just wants me to bring some chimes here. So click on it. Return chimes. You've pushed back the storm. <gasps> oh! Did they? Did I have a chime on me, maybe? Whoa, and we get a gift, too! Wow, okay. That's wonderful. So, the biggest part and coolest part of this game, I would say, is definitely going to be... Ooh, Ziggy. Find six pieces to build, then completed, you get Thief's Sail. Oh, so it wants us to actually build that boat right there. And they'll give us... a different sail? Place markers for Ziggy. Okay, so, I mean, if we start anywhere, maybe we should just start out here. I mean, it's already got a waypoint on it, and I'm looking directly at it, so we'll start there, though. It seems like it wants us to craft a Ziggy, or does it want us to find all the pieces to Ziggy? Ring 1, chimes 2, Ziggy 10 of 16. Oh, so we don't have all the parts to build Ziggy right now, but it's going to teach us how to build a specific boat. Okay. So let's grab this bad boy. You are perfectly fine. And let's set sail over there. Alright, it's gonna be real hard to battle the wind here. Oh, I might have cut it. I cut it too hard. I cut it too hard and in the wrong direction. Uh, well. And... I don't know if this is gonna keep going, but we're gonna give it a try. We're gonna keep trying. I'll see if I can get somewhere like this. Heck yeah. Look at that. We only have, like, half a boat, but we still got it. We're still good. Half a boat don't care. Let's do it. This is like a sea skimmer. That's what I'm going to call this. I'm going to build it like this. Where the front is in the water. And so is the lantern, and it's still lit. Still lit, fam. Still lit. Alright, so I'm heading towards this island over here. Uh, are we losing wind? 
Oh, it's taking wind and it's it's turning me now. So I think the way the wind goes, it goes in a circle around the tower. So you really have to kind of plan accordingly. And there's definitely no way that I'm going to be able to go to that island. But I think we can make it to that one. Especially with the wind on our side. Yeah, definitely be able to make it to that one. And we're going to crash land again. I do like how you just kind of get your boat back. But maybe they should make like a hardcore mode in the future. Where if your boat crashes, you are Audi. And look at that big giant floating fish again. What is that thing going to do to me? Is the question. I'm not sure what it's going to do. Don't kill me, please. Please don't kill me. Alright. Look at it though. It's like a big giant floating puffer fish, but uglier. If I ever told you guys, I did go to like Mexico when I was little. And we went snorkeling. And this puffer fish went right up to my goggles and just went Phoom! and just puffed right up in front of me. I screamed, got out of the water, never went in again. I went back in the ocean again, just not in that instance. <laughs> it's like, I'm afraid of puffer fish, so I don't go in the ocean anymore. If there's puffer fish in this game, I'm going to kill myself. I hate it. I hate puffer fish. I'm just kidding. They're normal. They're okay with me now. We chill. We chill. All right. Here we go, and the perfect parking situation. Huh, I want to jump off. And there goes my entire boat. I wanted to jump off before I hit that thing. Uh, okay. Where is anything on this? Ooh, is that a wind chime? What are you? An eye pole? Okay, so that's a part of Ziggy. Good thing there's a spot to actually build your boat again, because... <laughs> definitely gonna need that. Yeah. All right, so let's set sail again. And we need to go... This way. Let's raise the sail. Oh, whoa, we really caught the wind and went underwater there. Oh god, turning a little fast. We're fine though, like I said, this build is perfect. We don't need anything else. This build is the best. So if you guys are enjoying this game so far, please click the like button. Remember to press the subscribe button as well and click on the little bell icon because uh, if you guys want to see more, the support on the series is what shows that you want more of the game. So if the series ever dies off and ends, it's just because the support wasn't enough. So be sure if you like it to make sure you do support it. And that goes across all of my channel, not just this game. So remember that if you like a game, make sure you're telling me that you enjoy it. Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, all over the place. And I'll be sure to continue it. Alright, just kind of going left and right here, you know? Keeping us straight by just going left and then right, and then left and then right. Let's get a full speed crash landing. Here we go. Here we go. Is there a spot to rebuild here? There has to be, right? There has to be. I'm really assuming that there has to be. Wonderful. Alright. Alright. I just got stuck, so I had to press R. And where did it put me? It put me all the way back to where I was? That's annoying. Oh, let's set sail again. Maybe we shouldn't crash land and then jump on top of our barrel. So it brings you back to the last build location. Which is kind of understandable. Like, I can see why. They don't want you to just, just jump in the ocean, press R, and just end up on the next island you're supposed to get to. Before, I was thinking, I was like, oh god, the map is way too small. I didn't want to bring it up because, like, it's early access and whatnot, but... We unlocked more of the island before, so that's pretty cool. So there's the tower there. And I'm hoping that we can carry more than one chime at a time. Because I feel like carrying one back and forth all the time would kind of stink. Plus with the circle wind, like how do you get back? It must be quite difficult. Alright, we're approaching the same island again. I'm going to go for a normal landing this time around. A normal, normal landing. Nice park action right there. Look at that. And just skirt right into place. I think that barrel did break, but I did my job again. Here we go. I want to try to not land on one of those barrels again. It seems like it glitches you out. So this should be another piece of Ziggy. Yay! Another piece of Ziggy in our hands. Okay. Let's keep getting all the pieces of Ziggy and then put Ziggy together, shall we? So I read there was creatures and monsters and enemies and that type of stuff. Obviously they could be added later, or maybe just since I'm kind of still in like tutorial mode almost. That they might attack later. 
down the line, and I'm hoping that there might be, like, some type of defense thing. Like, you know how I have the narwhal spear in the front? Because maybe I gotta ram them? I don't know, I'm hoping that there's other, like, ships that are, like, pirates. Where they need to, they're trying to take my ship or something. Alright, we're coming in hot. Sail down. And it's also very, very hard to see the bottom. Very hard to see the bottom. I always hit it. Always. I always want to go for a clean landing and then I can't. So eel plank, Ziggy, it's done now too. And now let's go on to the next island. We have a few more pieces of Ziggy. Let's change something up. So we have these eel planks. Have you ever tried to grab an eel with your hands? Neither have I. That's kind of fun. Many miso bean reens considered eyes to be lucky. Seeing the safety is always being watched. Seeing the safety is always being watched by the gods, so they put eyes everywhere. It's a little creepy. I mean, I'll put it on my boat. Okay, that's not where I was anticipating on putting it. I just wanted to put it, like, above the ship. As just, like, a pole. Yeah, see? Just a random pole. That's all it is. Actually, we should probably move that pole. You want? No. Screw the pole. I want... A... Another sail. I want to try another sail for size. Let's try the double sail. Alright. So let's set sail. I think a storm came in, though. So this might not be the best time. And if we click... Here... I believe we're heading in the proper direction. Holy crap. Wow. Okay. We are flying. We are going almost twice as fast as before. Ooh. Whoa. Whoa, 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 Okay. My ship doesn't like that. All right. Put the sails down. Put the st We lost one. We lost one. Just just throw it in the ocean. We don't, we don't need that anymore. Get out of here. All right. Put the sails back up. Let's cut. We need to go right. I'm cutting the wrong way. I'm cutting the wrong way. It's inverted. It's inverted. All right. Is it because we're close to the edge or is it because a storm rolled in? I think a nighttime storm actually rolled in. We were going quite fast there. Oh, it's probably because of the storm. I mean, the double sail definitely helped it there. But the storm is absolutely just tossing us around. All right. I think it's calming. I think it's calming down. I think it's definitely calming down a little bit. Okay. Okay. Let's go get the, this next piece. Next piece time. Oh, wow, this one looks a little different. So look at this one. It's got like a... Like, kind of looks like a piece of the tower almost on it. That's kind of cool. Oh, there's some gifts there, too. Ooh, gifts! Fun! Gimme! Gimme, gimme, gimme! So we got another piece of Ziggy. What are you? Little windless? Oh, so that goes without wind? With two jets and an energy vacuum, you can sail anywhere. Jets? Unless there's no energy source nearby, range is pretty limited without an energy tank. Just keep near jellyfish. Ooh. So, when completed, you get the jellyfish battery. Pulls energy from jellyfish. Energy can use for jet, jets, propellers, tethers, and more. Oh. I don't think the storm has expanded yet, though, so I don't think it's going to help us at all. So Little Windless is going to be another quest of ours, and then Zaggy. So there's Ziggy, and then there's Zaggy. Logs, barrels, and, and a sail. And you in the middle. Square base. This base piece is square, letting you build on all sides. Oh! That's kind of cool, so you can build like a raft versus like a ship. Okay. And where are these ones? Oh, these pieces are actually on top of the other pieces there. So that's kind of nice. Like, some of these islands will have a lot of the different pieces. But we're still working on Ziggy here. We still need to work on Ziggy, and then we can do Little Windless and Zaggy. Because I think we need to find another piece. Unless this is another piece right here. <gasps> I think it is. I think we found... Yeah, we found a chime! So we bring that back, and it will expand the storm. We need to go here for two pieces, which we need to go pretty far. I think we started here... Like, this is our starting island, so we still need to do one long trip to here, and then build Ziggy. So, let's start here. Let's go on over. Uh, I don't know if I want to double sail it, but we'll give it a try without a storm to see how it goes. Oh, I don't know where I'm supposed to be going. I'm assuming right there. Oh, the sail just broke off instantaneously. Well, that's wonderful. 
That's exactly what I was trying to do. Just throw it in the water. We don't need it. Just like last time. All right, here we go. Let's go get the last pieces of Ziggy. So in ring one, there are two chimes. We've already delivered one. I think it started with a chime or I picked it up at some point and I didn't realize. But we're about to bring chime two, which is going to expand the storm and go to the next area. So after I get these pieces, we're probably going to end the episode because uh, we'll build Ziggy in the next one if you guys did enjoy enough. You guys will obviously be letting me know if you did enjoy the game. Because I do want to take on some new boats, like maybe do a, a new boat every episode. So right at the start, we'll build something special. Uh, we'll build Ziggy, of course. We need to build Ziggy at some point for our quest. And then uh, maybe we can adjust Ziggy how we want it to be. And then there's the jellyfish battery, which is really cool. And uh, we'll be able to actually have jet propulsion on our ship, which is going to change the game heavily versus a wind sail. Oh, I hope I don't miss. I hope I don't miss because we are pretty much going into the wind right now. I just heard a little noise. It could have just been the boat creaking, though. Could have just been the boat creaking. All right, so Houston, we have a problem. I think I got to swim the rest of the way. Oh, that wasn't too bad. My dude swims swims pretty pretty fast. All right. Jump up on the island, please. All right, so we got another piece of Ziggy, which is a small roof. Okay. A small roof. That's kind of cool. And blueprint, completion reward, thief sale. So it gave us a thief sale for learning how to build Ziggy. We're going to build Ziggy later. And we got the last chime, which was right here as well. So we have both of them. So next episode, we're going to return the chimes. We're going to build Ziggy. Let me know if you want to see that. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Adios.